What's happening, folks? Welcome to my YouTube channel, Mailman Down EDC. This past Saturday, I did an unboxing video on a package that was sent to me by Mr. Ryan Acevedo. Now, I knew what was in the package. I just didn't know what was in the package. And it was a complete surprise to me. And I greatly appreciate Ryan for sending me that. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. Y'all take care, stay safe out there. So what's happening, Mailman Down EDC Faithful? Check it out. An unboxing video. This is from Mr. Ryan Acevedo. He sent me this. I know what's in the box. I just don't know what's in the box. You know what I mean? Ryan is that type of guy that he'll surprise you. And it'll be a good surprise. So... Here we go. I picked this box up from my mail carrier this morning because I saw that it came in out for delivery today. What's well, supposed to be here till Monday, right? So I picked this box up around, hmm, might've been around 11, 12 o'clock, something like that. And now it is 5.07. And I am just now getting to unboxing this thing because I was out running errands, going to other towns, things like that. This box has been riding with me in the back of the truck, in the back seat of the truck. And every now and then I'd hear it, open me. Please open me. Please, please open me. And I'd yell back there, shut up! I ain't got time for this shit now. I gotta make a video out of you. Stand by. <laughs> so here we are. And guess what? This is what we're gonna open it with. The old St. Nick's exclusive giant mouse, ace grand with an EDC micro lanyard on it. Micro lanyards dot EDC EDC dot micro lanyards. Woo woo. West and Debbie. I tell y'all what. Awesome stuff. So here we go. Where do we start? Well, let's start on the side here. Okay. And as you can tell, Ryan did not spare any expenses on packing tape. So we got to cut this bitch. Uh, go this way with it. Okay. Easy does it. Mm-hmm. Work smarter, not harder. Let the knife do the work. <sighs> Here we go. Y'all ready for this? Oh, by the way, I put skip bearings in this thing last night. And can I tell a difference? <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> it opens and closes just as good as it did with the stop bearings in it. So anyway, maybe later on I can tell, but not right now. So here we go. Check it out. Put that baby out of the way. Mm -mm. Like I said, I know what's in the box. I just don't know what's in the box. Here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, look. Y'all, look. Oh, my God. I love these things. He sent me some damn popcorn. Wait, is this the biodegradable popcorn? Let me put it in my mouth, I'll tell you. Good ground floor is. The shit starts melting when it hits water. <laughs> Don't try that on. I mean, you could swallow that damn thing and choke yourself, and then you'll be in the hospital, you know, and they'll bring you after they done, uh, you know, cleared you, clear, like a couple of times. Well, I was watching Mailman Down EDC, and he put one in his mouth, and I thought I could do the same thing too, but I got fucking choked. So here we go. <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm at the house by myself, so that's why I'm getting kind of loud. So let's take all the popcorn out. Here's the popcorn. Here's just some popcorn. Yes, it is biodegradable popcorn, so it's safe for all marine, marine animals. If they want to eat it, they can. It'll dissolve in their mouth. <laughs> Get it? Melt in your mouth, not in your hands. Wait a minute, they don't have hands. So it'll be melt in your mouth, not in, well, not on your flippers, I guess. It's all right. Look at all that paper right there, y'all. You know what you can do with this paper? Ball it up. Chunk it. Just like that. Yep, there it is, right there, look at that. See, now I knew this was in the box. This is a Chris Reeves. Let me make sure there's nothing else in the box. Bubble wrap half popped. Thanks, Ryan. 
cheap ass. <laughs> Just playing. Chris Reeves. All right. This is my first Chris Reeves knife. Never owned one. Never held one. Never even touched a box that one was in or that one came in. So this is my first one. Chris Reeves knives. Look at there. Y'all ready for that? Look at that. Small Sabenza. Say it with me. Sabenza. Say it sexy. Mmm. Sabenza. Say it forcefully. Sabenza. 31 plane. Small Sabenza 31 plane. And Singo glass blasted silver hardware. CPMS 35V yen. And a 6A. 14V titanium, baby. Anything else? Nope. Anything else? Oh, look. Crucible CPM. High performance materials. You got that shit right. All right. Chris Reeves. Knives. Here we go. Take this baby out of the box. <sighs> okay. Set this to the side. Here's our little booklet. Oh! Stickers! God damn, I love stickers, man. I love them. Y'all know I'm working on my uh, my trunk that I'm uh, storing all my knife stuff in. And when you flip the lid up, there's all kinds of stickers in there. This one's going to be right in there with it. Look at that. Look at that. Little, sort of like a little certificate of authenticity. Authenticity. Uh, CPMS 35EN. Silver hardware. 6A14V titanium. Glass blasted. Date of December 28th, 2021. Almost a year ago. Mm-hmm. Set this to the side. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Okay, this, okay, that, that, okay, that's got some heft to it. So that's the knife. We're gonna set that to the side for now. Look at here. Oh, oh, ch oh, shit! I gotta put my glasses on. Look at this. Look at this shit right here. I told you. He's always putting something else in there. This is not part of Mr. Chris Reeves. This, oh, oh, damn. <laughs> Yeah, look at that. A 3D mill clip, and is that that Damascus, Damascus, uh, 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 Jurassic Saurus, Tyrannosaurus? I don't know what the hell it is. Badass. <laughs> you badass. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I love this thing. Mm, I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's, uh, let's set you right there. Look at that. Now we got uh, more little baggies. More little baggies. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Okay, he did say something about a land. Oh. 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 Mm. Now, this right here is not for the Sabenza. It could be for Para 3, Paramilitary 2, or a Manix 2, but check it out. Same pattern as the clip. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Look at that. Oh, well, put you back in, the, in your little bag right there. Look at this. Man. Woo -hoo -hoo. It's getting better already. Okay, what else we got here? Oh, we got it. Okay, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah. We got a silver lanyard plug. Silver lanyard plug. Now, if you like, if you don't like the hole, plug it up. That's what you do. Plug it up. <laughs> and we've got screws. Oh, looks like blue anodized screws. This says, if I could read the writing on it, it's kind of like. Uh, uh, fade it out, but it says, S -s 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 I'll ask him about it. I'll say, what are those screws for? He'll tell me. So, anyway, but yeah, I'm sure he's going to be watching this anyway. Mr. Ryan Acevedo. Yes, sir. You see this guy in the groups, I'm telling you. One of the best. One of the best. Yes. Ryan Acevedo. That's right. San Francisco 49ers faithful. Los Angeles Kings hockey team. Don't question him about the Kings. Don't question. He know. He knows. He he loves. Is he? Is, is he? Okay. Okay. Now this does come with the Chris Reeves thing because I saw the video on it. This has got your little lanyard, your little uh, 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 screw or uh, greases and, and and Allen wrenches and and they do they do send a little lanyard like this. And look at this. This is the backspacer. It's a little back. Now, these backspacers, and I was kind of confused about these now. These aren't your typical backspacers like you normally see, you know, like uh, like in the old Ace Grand, you know, like right there. That's a, that's a backspacer. To me, this is a backspacer. When it goes all the way down the spine, that's a backspacer. 
Like the same thing with a pair of military uh, two and a pair of three, you know, the Manix two, you know, you put the back spacers on them, right? But with the Sabenzas, from what I've been seeing and reading and all that kind of stuff, it's just a little bitty, a little bitty round thing, almost like a, a lanyard tube, really. Put it in, um, on either side or, you know, like in between the scales, put your screws in it, boom, back spacer. <laughs> there you go. This is a silver one. There's another silver one. Now, that's, this is what your lanyard goes in right here. Here, I'll take this out, I'll show you. Now, this is, this is pretty cool to me. I didn't know this until I saw it in a video. But, check it out. You see how, this is 550 paracord, right? It runs through a hole. This is solid right here, but there's a hole drilled in it, and the paracord runs through it. So, when you take your scales and you put them around this thing, boom, it's at the end of your, just pretend this is the end of the scales, right? This little baby hangs off right there like that. There's your lanyard right there. Now, if you don't want to, if you don't want to use your lanyard, just take this thing out, cut this off, put your little tube back in there so you plug the hole up, and voila, no lanyard. So there's that. So we got that. And that's nice. This is nice. Now I'm gonna put this back with this, dude. Y'all, this clip and that damn lanyard tube just blew me the fuck away. I am not lying, but that's some awesome shit right there, man. Woo hoo! I love it. Love it. All right. Let's get you out of the way, put you over there, get the old clip back, put him back in here with this little bag right here. And y'all, we're about to get to what is in, wrapped up in the loincloth. It's not really a loincloth. I just wanted to do a little Tarzan reference right there. Ooh. All right, here we go. Anything else in the box? Just make sure, because Ryan likes to put shit in here. There ain't no damn snake or nothing under there. Nope. Okay, we're good. All right, here we go. This feels good. This feels really, really good. It's almost wrapped up like when you go to Subway and you get your Subway sandwich. This video is not sponsored by Subway sandwiches. Matter of fact, it ain't sponsored by anybody. Just a video on YouTube. On my YouTube channel, which by the way, you may have noticed I have changed my video name, YouTube video channel name to Mailman Down EDC. Now, Ryan Acevedo, Ryan Acevedo was instrumental in me changing the name of my YouTube channel. Because when I do live videos and stuff like that, I'm out there riding around in the mail truck. I dropped my phone one time, right? <laughs> and Ryan comes over, he says, mailman down. I was like, yeah, mailman down, mailman down. So that's where it came from. It used to be junk mail and jimping, which was also cool. Yeah, I'm still unwrapping this thing, y'all. It's still, oh, son of a bitch. Wow, holy crap. Mm -hmm. There's the blue lanyard tube right there. There's where the, oh, and the blue back spacer. Y'all, just, mm. Oh, oh. Mm. oh, 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 look at that blade. Look at that blade. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Oh, damn. Why did I wait so long for Chris? Wow. Ooh. Mm. Now, I got to work on some things with this. I got to figure out how to flick this thing because if you notice, the thumb stud it's basically for right-handers, right? Because right? it only punches out on one side, comes out on one side, it doesn't come out on the other side. Now you can, however, send this back to Chris Reeves and they can put you in a two or a, a, a two stud or a dual stud or or double dong or whatever you want to call it, but it ain't a deal though, because you can't necessarily take these things out with a screw, a flat tip screwdriver like you can with other regular thumb studs. These things are pressed in from what I understand. I think that's what Ryan told me. But, uh, oh, wow. And this is the Sabenza 31 small. Only difference in the small and the large is, well, the large is larger. But for the most part, sweet Mary and Joseph. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is badass, y'all. Mr. Acevedo, I cannot thank you enough, brother. I cannot thank you enough. You have come through yet again. And I will be contacting you shortly. <laughs> Wow. Freaking awesome, y'all. Y'all have a wonderful day. Thank y'all for watching. Hit the little subscribe button if you like the channel. And we'll see y'all on the next round.
Oh, Lord, mailman down, mailman down.